is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. You know just where it's at. Right down there. Right down there. It is time to follow my Instagram. That's Geekly Amanda. G-E-E-K-L-Y Amanda. It's the same on Twitter. Make sure to follow me there too. It's time to get this retro video started. All right, y'all. Well, yesterday during my live, you know we've been talking about all the the um Maharashtra and the and the Krishnas. I've been doing the little Krishna episodes and anything, but then we started discussing Krishna the Krishna's birth, and someone told me that that he was born in like jail or I was like what? They told me I should check out this Krishna the the story of his birth. So I was like, well, we got to do that right away. Y'all ready to check this out? Because I'm so intrigued well, just by our discussion yesterday. But all I've been learning about this. So y'all ready? Let's go. All right, there we go. One summer day in Mathura, Vasudev and his new wife, Princess Devki, were headed back home. Devki's cousin, Prince Kamsa, was dropping them. Okay. Now let me tell you about Kamsa. He was a cruel and ruthless man. Oh. Shivers ran down what? the spine of most people that encountered him, including his own family. Oh, he had nice. even imprisoned his own father. Kamsa was zipping through the village as fast as his horses could take him. Get out of the way, you peasants! What a mean guy! <laughs> oh, I don't like him! Vasudev, look at the little people run! <sighs> Suddenly, the sky cracked open. It started to thunder, and from the heavens, a loud voice boomed. Okay, all right, now it's getting good. You fool! You shall die. That uh, that came from the, the eighth the... son born to Devki will slay. Oh! The chariot came to a sudden halt. Kamsa pulled Devki by the hair, took out his sword, <gasps> and yelled. Your eighth child will kill me? <laughs> well, not if I kill you first. Oh my goodness. Devki cried out in pain. Come, sir, let me go. Vasudev acted quickly. He gripped Kamsa's hand and managed to free Devki loose. Oh Vasudev pleaded. Come, sir, stop. She's your sister. Kamsa That's his sister. Aged. I he was will gonna not kill be his sister. killed by a child that is still to be well, just, born. You just be nice he then. Up his sword That's what you get for being strike. such a bad person. Please, please don't kill us. If it will oh. save Devki's life, we will hand over our children to you when they are born. What? Begged Vasudev. Oh, Kamsa sad. was not pleased, but gave him. Oh. I'll spare Devki. But I need to be certain you won't go back on your word. So Kamsa oh, locked wow. them in a dungeon. <gasps> that's what you're you, talking about Kamsa in the jail. Kamsa visited Devki and Vasudev oh, every time they had a child. Soon they lost six children. Oh, when my their goodness. seventh child was about to be born, Vasudev couldn't take it anymore. We must save the oh. child. Devki looked at him with disbelief. How can we do that? Wonder, what did he do with the first? Diamond, what did he do with the other ones? Dungeon. Nobody would challenge him. He even imprisoned his own father. Vasudev reached out, held Devki, and said, Don't lose hope. Remember, there is a prophecy. That's true. That's true. A few days later, the seventh child was born. Uh -oh, Miraculously, happened? the child was carried to Gokul by a mysterious being. Kamsa was it told, was like a girl. the child is no more. Kamsa was elated. Just one more child to be born. This child is supposed to be the slayer of the mighty Kamsa? <laughs> I don't like him. We I don't shall. like him! Soon it was the month of Shravan, which is mostly mid-July, early August. One night it was raining heavily oh, okay. and there was thunder and lightning oh. everywhere. 
Devki's eighth child was about to be born. Devki and Vasudev were worried. A little past midnight, the child was born. Much to the couple's surprise, the child did not cry or attract attention. Vasudev saw it as a sign. He is the most beautiful child. And look, Devki, he knows that he should not cry. I wish I could get out of these chains. Oh, just, just to hold, hold my son. Oh, As so he said sad. this, his chains came off <gasps> and he was free. What? The doors of the dungeon also flew open. What? Devki oh, and Vasudev held their breath for a moment. But when no guards came running in, Vasudev acted fast. He that's, quickly that's grabbed the child, like... placed him in a nearby basket and decided to make a run for it. Devki our friend Nanda in Gokul will be able what to look to after mom? the child. Did she get to go? Wish me luck. Devki said, oh, the was even you don't need luck. Look the gods are on our side. Oh, that's true. Vasudev placed the basket on his head and walked out of the door. He saw the guards were fast asleep oh, and ran were. as fast Lucky's as he even could. A little blue baby. Until he reached the river Yamuna. The Yamuna River was now in full flood and turbulence due to the rain. It was the only thing that stood in the way of Vasudev and the town of Gokul. Did he put After the basket finding no the other river? way to cross, Vasudev decided to take on the waters. As soon as Vasudev began walking through, the water started rising. However, as soon as the child's feet touched the water, the river parted and what? gave Vasudev a safe path across. That's like the story. As soon as he had passed through, in the Bible that I know, as like a Moses. Vasudev finally reached Gokul and could hear the cries of a newborn baby. Oh. Vasudev knew instantly that the cries were coming from Nanda's home. He entered and saw the newborn next to Nanda's wife, Yashoda. Vasudev picked up his own son, walked to the cradle, softly kissed him on the forehead, oh. and replaced him with Nanda's He replaced child. him? And picking up Nanda's child, he, he said, switched him. We have a girl. I'm sure Kamsa won't harm a baby girl. I really hope not. He then oh placed the goodness. baby girl in the basket and that. quickly started back to Kamsa's palace. Vasudev returned to the palace and found the guards exactly as he had seen them. He switched them. Fast asleep. He entered the dungeon and the doors oh, magically that, shut uh, behind oh, wait, did, uh, A few what minutes happened later, baby? the child began to cry. What happened with that baby? The guards woke up and quickly ran to inform Kamsa about the birth of the eighth child. Kamsa hopped out of bed, got dressed and ran to the dungeon. This was the moment he was waiting for. When he got down there, he spotted Devki holding the child close to her heart and Vasudev standing over her. When Vasudev saw Kamsa, he screamed, No, Kamsa, this is just a baby girl. What harm can she do? Let this go. Kamsa wasn't listening. All he could spot was the child that was supposed to slay him. Oh, please don't, please With don't. With a look of baby. absolute madness, he grabbed the oh. child and was about to do the unthinkable when the child just flew out of his hand and towards the heavens, Kamsa was stumped. What? Through the thunder and lightning, a voice boomed again. It shattered glasses and threw open doors and could be heard throughout the palace. Kamsa, the one who shall destroy you still lives. Kamsa, shaking with anger. Stormed out I of the dungeon, he was thinking he should have killed them. guards to put Vasudev <laughs> and Devki in chains again and let them rot in the dungeon forever. Oh, that is so sad! And this was the miraculous beginning of Krishna's journey. Oh, that, oh, how heartbreaking. What a terrible person! This video was adapted from an Amar. Oh, that comes, I don't like him! Now I want to know everything. Well, I'm watching the little Krishna episodes in this teeth. Like, I'm learning so much from that. But it did, it sure, I can see why the little Krishna episodes didn't even, it went to right when he's a little kid and not a baby, because that is so heartbreaking. 
He was gone. Kill a little newborn. What did he do with the other seven? Do they even have stories about that? The Krishna's brother. I get were they all boys or girls? That one looked like number seven. That looked like a girl. So brothers and sisters, what happened to them? I need to know. I need to know it all. All right. That was just. That was so sad. Let me know what you think. Comments, thumbs, and all that. Till next time, y'all.